I was so devastated and so very, very heartbroken. Chelsea Hibbert is the mother of a two year old girl. She says she cried when she heard about what happened down the street from her apartment. That's where five year old Tyshawn Newby Jr. was hit and killed by a pickup truck. Police say the driver hit Tyshawn as he was turning into the Victoria Gardens apartments off Whispering Brook Drive. He was so young and we have so many children that play around out here and, and as a parent, you look at it and you couldn't imagine. John Spaulding is the spokesperson for the Victoria Gardens apartments. He says the driver of the pickup truck was a maintenance worker at the complex. He was just, you know, a wreck emotionally, and I'm sure that he, he still is distraught. Um, I mean, anytime this would this type of thing happens to somebody you can only imagine. While this makeshift memorial continues to grow on Monday, students and faculty also mourned at Blue Lick Elementary School where Tyshawn attended school. His grandfather says he loved the Head Start program. In a statement, Principal Amy Ullman says in part, we are deeply saddened with the loss of our Blue Lick student. She went on to say, our thoughts are with the family during this difficult time. It was just a horrific uh, accident that you just don't want to see. And um, I know that all trade in Victoria Gardens join, you know, sending their heartfelt condolences to the family.